Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Mad Medicine. In this video, we are going to be talking about transference. And this is gonna be a quick, short video about it, not too much to talk about, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you guys like what we're doing. Now, with that being said, let's talk about transference. Transference is a phenomenon that occurs a lot in the medical workplace, and it's pretty much when a patient projects his or her feelings about family or someone important in their life onto the physician. And you know, a lot of times this can actually strain the physician-patient relationship. It can cause uh, problems when you're treating a patient because the patient may not be receptive. And these feelings can sometimes be pro, but often it's negative feelings towards someone in their family or someone close to them that's being projected onto the physician. So let's talk about you know an example. We could have a patient who dislikes his or her doctor. Now this could just be because a doctor is a crappy doctor. As you have a shitty doctor, he doesn't care or she doesn't care or they don't spend enough time with you, you're gonna get upset because hello, you are feeling sick and the, the physician came in for two minutes and then walked away, right? But it could also be because the patient is transferring their feeling upon you. And that could be because the doctor may remind the patient of his or her parents. You know, that's just one example. But the way this would work is, let's say the physician came in and was just telling a patient to stop eating junk food, okay, because they're overweight. And the patient might have heard this a lot from their parents growing up. And they may, that might be a tender moment for them, that might be a sensitive part uh, that they don't like hearing. So they may project the anger and you know the guilt they got from their parents onto the physician and take it out that way. That doesn't mean the patient doesn't like the physician, it just means that they're transferring you know, their feelings from their parents upon the physician, just because the physician kind of reminds them of their parents. Now, there is a phenomenon called counter-transference that also occurs in the medical workplace, and that's pretty much the exact opposite of transference, where a doctor projects their feelings about family or other persons onto the patient. Now, remember, transference was when a patient projects their feelings onto a, uh, a physician. Counter-transference is when a doctor projects their feelings on to a patient. And this is very, very important and something as future physicians you guys should definitely watch out for because it can definitely strain your relationship with your uh, patient a lot more than transference can. And one good example of this would be if a patient reminds a physician about uh, of their child. Let's say you have a, a patient who you know doesn't exercise and you have a child who doesn't exercise and you're struggling to get them active so you may take that frustration with your child out on to the patient because the patient may also you know not be active so just because you're upset with your child you may take it out on on the patient that is a very very bad thing to do and you do not want that so let's just write you know counter transference is really bad often now another example would be um, let's say a patient reminds a physician of their parents. Let's say the patient is elderly. This may be a good example of countertransference where if the patient reminds a physician of his or her elderly parents, they may go out of their way to take care of that patient. Now, obviously this isn't fair for the rest of the patients, but as far as that single patient is concerned, it actually benefits them and takes it improves their health. But nonetheless, as future physicians, as doctors, as medical students, you should be very uh, well aware of the phenomenon of counter-transference and transference. Now that's pretty much all we got for transference. I hope you guys got a lot out of it. I hope this helped. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And when you subscribe, don't forget to hit the bell notification on the side so every time we post, you can get notified. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys back here real soon. Take it easy, fam. Yeah.